I found out you, you could buy these expensive rare fish online. Some are rarer than others, obviously, and that makes them more expensive. I mean, look at that, just insane fish. This is the most money we've ever spent on fish. Holy, ah! Come on, who's hungry? Look at the water. Oh, it's like falling apart. Oh no, that's not good. This little fish was actually $600. One of the rarest Placos you can get. And he goes, oh my God. What is up, VFV Nation? Welcome back to another awesome video, guys. Today, we are buying the most rare, expensive fish possible online. Now, I don't know what's going on with me recently, guys, but as you've seen from the channel, from the videos, I've been buying a lot of rare, expensive fish. So excited, $400. I'd say it's worth it. That's the coolest fish we have. I'm gonna say it, look at that thing. This is the first one I've ever seen, and he is for sale for $800. All right, you guys, Armada Mata is in the bin right here. But I think this is worth it, you guys. I am so happy right now. I mean, look at these things. Two Tigrinus catfish. And you guys have loved watching it. So here I am yet again, guys. It all started with Abby, our Ava Ava knife fish. Really rare fish from Africa. Super cool. Never seen anything like it. And she was only about $400. Now that seems like a lot for one singular fish, but compared to all the other things we've been buying recently, that actually is not that much. We bought an $800 Mata Mata turtle. Freaking huge Mata Mata turtle straight from the Amazon. We also bought two Tigrinus catfish, also from the Amazon and they totaled $750. So yeah, guys, we've been on a little, you know, crazy fish, expensive fish run. And you guys have been enjoying it. Now, one thing I will say that has kept me from going bankrupt already is that for me to buy these fish, they have to kind of present themselves to me. They have to be in a fish store and I have to have the chance to buy it. So I can't be buying these fish every single day because, you know, they're that rare. You're not going to see them every day until I found this website. Okay. I found out you, you could buy these expensive rare fish online and that is not good okay guys i'm gonna be spending way too much money on this website but it's cool okay i was on the website last night i found it i was browsing through all the fish their big selection and i was trying to find the rarest most expensive fish because that's what i'm drawn to and i stumbled upon the placo section you guys know placos the alien fish we call them we catch them all the time here in south florida now you guys are probably like why are you buying a placo you can catch them if you guys didn't know placos have over 150 different species some are rarer than others obviously and that makes them more expensive and I had no idea that any of these existed honestly and I had no idea they were so expensive I stumbled across a few that were a lot of money but they were really cool so I bought them I bought two Placos and I'll tell you right now um, two fish equaled over a thousand dollars so yeah these Placos are pretty cool I guess you could say that hopefully they're worth it they were the most expensive fish on the website and I bought them so they're coming today and we are getting prepared for them guys I'm setting up a whole new tank for them and yeah, I'm very excited. This is the most money we've ever spent on fish, guys. This is freaking insane. I think one was like $600 and the other was maybe close to $400 with taxes and shipping easily over $1,000, guys. So yeah, we're waiting. I'm just waiting for the mailman to come up and uh, present me my fish. But right now, I'm gonna give you an update on all those crazy rare fish I just talked about, even the turtle, show you how they're doing. And yeah, I am freaking excited, guys. Let's go see how the Mata Mata Turtle's doing. All right, guys, here we are at the Mata Mata Turtle Pond. Now, this turtle was $800, and I'm going to let you guys try to find him, okay? He's not very easy to spot, even though he's freaking massive. He's wider than my chest. So, yeah, go ahead, take a look. Helen, can you find him? Um corner yep that's yeah. a spot now guys this turtle camouflages and acts like a leaf and then they wait for the bait fish to swim past their face and then boom they attack look at this guy oh my gosh he's doing amazing this is justin turtle lake look how massive that mana mana turtle is literally huge now we also put a bunch of mollies and comic cichlids in here for his food they're also doing really well they're breeding a lot creating a lot of food for him let's take him out and show you guys how he's doing wakey wakey justin Please don't bite me. Oh God, please don't bite me. Oh my God, look at this thing. Holy, ah, it's freaking huge guys. So up until now, I think this is the most money we've ever spent on like a fish or even a turtle, $800. And we're topping that today. We spent over a thousand on two Placos. But yeah, he is just crazy. Look at him. Look at that, it looks like a leaf. His head is shaped like a leaf. Sorry to disturb. Oh. Okay, he's not happy. We just had to give you guys a little update on him. Now we're gonna head inside, check on Abby. But first, actually, I'm gonna try and catch her some food. Look at her, oh, he's going back to the corner right now. All right, guys, I got a little pool net. Oh, there's the mollies right there. Snake it, oh, oh, oh. 
Oh, I got one. So this is what I feed Abby, my Abba Abba knife fish. I also feed her tilapia, but this is the feeder fish, all right, guys? We breed mollies in here. I'll come out here every day, catch a couple for her. Let's go in there and see if she'll eat. We're walking into the house right now. I have to show you this. Now, as you saw, we saved two frogs from the Asian food market recently. Look at this guy. He wants to come home. Oh, yeah. We put them with the Mata Mata. I guess they were too scared of it. So they jumped out and they found their new homes here in the mini pond. There's one right there. He literally does not leave this pond at all. He's been here for days now. The other one is also here. He, he's just a little shy, but yeah, they're doing great guys. Right here is Abby. How you doing, big girl? We recently upgraded her to the 125. She's doing amazing. So this was the fish that was $400 straight from Africa. They are known to be very deadly, very dangerous. And uh, this one, not so much. I'll show you right now all right abby feeding time come on come on who's hungry oh oh my god abby Abby, it's right down there, sweetie. Oh my God, she is so blind. One thing about these fish guys that, you know, definitely doesn't help them is their tiny little eyes. Look how small her eyes are. So they have to rely on their sensory organs to actually find the food. As you can see, she's totally lost. She has no idea where the molly went. It's it's right there, Abby. She's looking for it. She knows there's food in the tank. She just literally, she can't see it. But once she does find it, she will rip it in half like nothing. And she swam right past it. She probably won't catch it until it gets night to, oh, there it is. Oh, you were so close, Abby. She probably won't get to it until tonight when the lights go out. And right across from Abby's tank is her old tank. And in here we have the two Tigrinus catfish. Super rare fish. We got two for $750. They're getting so big already. All right, we're gonna open the lid. We got some shrimp here. This is their favorite food. They love it. We're gonna drop a few pieces in. Come on, guys. We'll drop in, we'll drop in three pieces. There's one in the little hide right there. Oh, and he smells it. Look at those little whiskers. They're going crazy. It's over there. Oh, wrong way. There's the other one. He's sitting in his little hut. He likes sitting in the pipe. Look how fat they are. See, look how chunky. Oh my God, they're getting so big. Just like the Abba Abba knife fish, these guys also have really bad eyesight and they rely on their whiskers to find the food. And clearly that is not working. All right, well, the Tigrinus are still trying to find the food. Let's see if Abby wants the rest of the shrimp. Come on, someone's got to eat today. I promise you guys, they eat. Come on, this one's not going to run away from you. Oh, look. Really? Oh, really? She's just playing with it. Oh. Oh, oh, she took a bite of it. She got a little nibble. Abby, come on. <laughs> no. These fish definitely have huge personalities. If they don't want the food, they're just gonna spit it out in your face and say no. So yeah, guys, as you can see, all the fish and the turtle are doing really well. All the expensive rare stuff we bought recently. And we're gonna add two fish to that list today. Hopefully, I don't know. I mean, it's getting pretty late. It said they're gonna be here today. We're still waiting. I don't see a box, all right? Now these Placos, the designer Placos, the ones that are more rare and expensive, they don't get as big as the big normal ones we catch here in Florida. And occasionally, you know, we'll catch the albinos as well. You can see one right there. Look how massive that one is. Giant albino placo but the ones we're getting today i think are also pretty big like really big for their species so i'm so freaking excited you guys let me pull out that albino placo right now just to give you guys an idea of what kind of fish we're buying today because they're so crazy looking they literally look like aliens i'm gonna sneak attack them hopefully this works because i want to show off the placo to you guys oh oh okay i think he's on to me you get back here right now oh no come on i just want to show you off Got him. Look at this thing. Oh my God. That is just unreal. Look at that. Now I will tell you guys, I'll give you one little hint. They're not the albino ones, the ones that we're buying. They're a lot more rare than that. Okay, I don't think you guys see the fish that we're getting today very often. That's what they're gonna look like. That general shape. There you go. That one right there, if I were to guess, maybe a hundred. $200 tops. The ones we're buying, a lot more expensive. And as I said earlier, guys, these two fish that we're buying today, we set up a whole new tank for them. And that is right here. This is a brand new tank. It's in the living room and we're gonna scape it to be the Amazon type of tank, all right? Giant driftwood, big flow, live plants. But right now, guys, it's out of commission. We're still working on the filtration system. So I don't think we're gonna be able to put the fish that we're buying today into here right away. So I have to think of a place to put them. But we can't put them here. I guess we could put them in the mystery pond, but it would definitely be very hard to catch them back out once that tank is ready. Could have put them with the Mata Mata, except I'm a little scared. Can't put them with the Oscars. I think they will just rip them to shreds. Same thing with the Predator Pond. I think one of the giant catfish could just engulf this thing at night. Cichlid Pond, I'm afraid all the cichlids would just nip at their fins. That's what cichlids do. So that's out of the options as well. Well, looks like we're running out of options, Abby. We could put it with Abby. 
theoretically. I just don't know how she would react. She might literally rip them in half or she might be buddies with them. We really don't know until we try it, but that would be an expensive mistake. <laughs> we could put them with the Tigrinus as well. Plinkos are pretty docile. I don't think they will harm the Tigrinus. So that might be our best and only option until the other tank is ready. Either way, guys, I'm sure these fish are gonna be just fine if they even come. I'm still waiting. So yeah, guys, I don't know when they're gonna show up. Hopefully it is today. That's when they say they're gonna come. So we're gonna get back to you guys once they show up and hopefully they're okay. Like I said, don't really order fish online all too much. I've only done it one time. So hopefully they make it. And yeah, I guess we'll see you there. Oh, oh God, here's my mom. Oh no, I have to tell her. Hello, I'm filming. Oh, so I didn't mean to interrupt you. <laughs> I'm waiting on my package right now. I bought fish. Why are you buying fish online? Because <laughs> they're cool. You get them for free. Okay, well, these you can't get for free. They're like rare. Mm -hmm. Sometimes you got to buy them. That's what the people want to see, these crazy fish. Are they real pretty? They're Placos. You know Placos. Oh, my God. <laughs> what? Hey. Placos. Why do you not like Placos? Uh, What's with the Placo hate? You uh, haven't even seen them. They're cool. <laughs> okay. Do you know how much they are? No, I don't. I don't think you do. They're $1,000. Oh, oh my God. <laughs> you haven't even seen them yet. They're worth it. They're like the rarest Placos you can get. $1,000 on Placos? <laughs> what? I don't understand why it's got to be about There's Placos. pretty fish in the <laughs> They're rare. I'll show you. I'm telling you right now. Once you see these fish, you'll understand why I got them. Well, I don't think she likes Blakos. All right, guys. It is actually nighttime later in the day. Our package has still not showed up, but I just heard a knock on the door. There's no way it is not the fish. So I'm very excited, guys. I'm nervous, too. I don't normally order fish online. I've only done it one time before. So hopefully everything is okay. Hopefully they made it. And yeah, guys, I'm just really excited for you guys to see these Blakos. And yeah, hopefully it was worth the money. Let's go see how they're doing. Oh, oh, there they are. Here's both. The, oh my God, it's wet. Uh oh, this one's leaking. Oh, I might have to blur out most of this because my address is all over it. I think there's a leak in the bag because this box is soaking wet. Look at the water. Oh, it's like falling apart. Oh no, that's not good. We got to get them inside right now. See, this is why you don't order fish online. Oh God. I got to get these things like out of this right now. Hopefully they're alive. Here we go. All right, let's set them on the floor right here. Okay, this box down here looks good, but this one, you guys, okay, there's two separate boxes. And this one, it looks like the bag may have ripped open. I mean, Plagos have very spiny fins. I don't know. Okay, let me get some scissors and cut this open. Okay, here we go. Oh, God, please. Please be alive. Oh, I'm so nervous. The bag, hopefully it has water still. Oh, my God, I see the... Okay, there's still a lot of water in here, and I see the Placo. Can you see him? Look. There it is right there. Okay, it looks like it's an all dark normal Playco. I promise you guys, it is special. Oh my God, there's a lot of water. Okay, here's the receipt. Okay, this is not good guys. We gotta get this thing out of here. I think he's good though. He looks all right, he's upright. Oh my God. Oh, this thing is so cool, look at this. He's all right, he's good. He looks okay. So that right there is not the most expensive one. There was one that was like 400, and then there was one that was like 600. This is the one that was 400. This is insane. I don't know what is going on, but the box is soaking wet. He must have ripped through it. But thankfully, I don't think it was that bad because there's still a decent amount of water and he looks to be okay. This one right here is called the Scarlet Cactus Placo. And yeah, they're super rare. I think they get about 18 inches max size. Look at that thing. Oh my gosh, that Placo is so cool. Okay, yeah, th he definitely does not have enough water because look, the top of his fin is actually out of the water right now. Hey, buddy. Now they actually call them Cactus Placos because they have spines all over them. And oh, 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 he's ready to go. Look at those spines just like a cactus. Can you see along his body there? That is just insane. Ow, ow, oh my God, they're sharp. Oh guys, I don't think we have any time to acclimate him right now. I think we gotta get him straight into the fish tank. I don't know, I don't wanna take any chances. I think he's been in here way too long. I said we get him straight out of here. This is so cool, guys. This little Placo was $400. How insane is that, you guys? Such a rare fish, and he's actually really big, too. But look at those spines all along his body and the beautiful red and orange fins. Gorgeous Placo. All right, we're going to get him straight into this fish tank. Look how cool that Placo is, you guys. Oh, this is so awesome. All right, let's get him in. There he goes. Oh my God. All right, he's sucking right onto the wall there. He looks good. Oh my gosh, he had me worried there. That bag was leaking. I was almost certain that that fish would be dead, but Plagos are very hardy fish. They can actually live out of water for multiple hours. So he does look okay. Yeah, these guys are really cool. And their eyes are so freaky. They actually blink. They have eyelids and they blink. It's so weird looking at them. But yeah, beautiful Placo. That's actually not even my favorite. The other one that we have 
is my favorite. Hopefully that one's alive. So let's see how he's doing. Once again, gonna have to blur this out. My address is all over it. Can't have you guys showing up at my house. Come on, please, please, please. This is my favorite. I really am excited to see this one. I don't know if you guys have seen anything like this before. They're very rare. One of the rarest Playcos you can get. And here we go. Okay, this one looks a lot better. Okay, where is it? I don't see it. Can you see it? I don't see a Playco. There he is. Okay, there he is right there. I am so excited right now. Let's get this bag open. Oh my God. Oh my God, it's freaking gorgeous. That right there is a sunshine Playco, you guys. Oh my God. This is insane right here. So this little fish was actually $600. And that is because they are one of the rarest Playcos that you can get and he is actually almost max size. I think they get about 11 to 12 inches. Look how big he is. That right there is a sunshine Playco. Oh my God, look at the dots on him. That is so freaking cool. Look at his mouth. Wow, oh, he's got teeth. What the heck? Look at, he's got little teeth. That is so insane, guys. Now it's so crazy because Playcos, like I said, there's over 150 different Playcos and each one kind of has, you know, different little characteristics and different markings and all that. And they're all just very unique. And yeah, this is one of the rarest ones you can get. And it's about max size. Oh my gosh, how cool is that, you guys? Here we go, we're gonna get him into the tank. Oh, he's ready. There he goes with his buddy. Oh, they're buds. They're best buds. Look at them. They're sitting on top of each other. Look at that. Oh my gosh. The cactus Playco, you can see, is a lot bigger than the sunshine. Oh my gosh, guys. How freaking cool is that? Thousand dollars worth of Playcos. Thank God they both made it alive. They look really good. But look how pretty they are. They are right next to each other too. That is really cool, guys. Comment down below which one your favorite is. Like I said, I think the sunshine's my favorite, but I don't know. The cactus one's really cool too. And the the thing about the cactus one is those spines, like I said. So that is insane, you guys. Well, they're here with the Tigrinus. Hopefully they play nice. Hopefully the Tigrinus plays nice. Like I said, we are escaping that tank. We're gonna get it ready for these Playcos. Look how cool that is, guys. That is just insane. Now these Playcos, they will eat the algae in this fish tank. So it's gonna be good that we have them in here. Cause as you can see on the back, there's lots of algae. Other than algae, they actually will eat meat. They'll eat wood. They'll eat just about anything. And yeah, I guess they don't really do much uh except look pretty thousand dollars worth of fish and they just sit there like statues wow i think it's worth it let me know if you think it's worth it these things are so freaking cool super happy thank god they made it all right what we're gonna do we're gonna give it a full day we're gonna come back and give you an update on the playcos just to fill you guys in and hopefully they make it through the day because you know i don't know where they came from but they were overnighted we ordered them last night and they're here today so hopefully they pull through and they make it and we got ourselves two awesome playcos for our collection we're gonna see you guys tomorrow and check on our playcos all right guys it has been a full day and sadly both playcos didn't make no i'm just kidding guys check it out both are still alive they are doing amazing there's the cactus playco i think actually uh-oh well the sunshine playco has gone oh there he is he's hiding behind the thing oh my god that scared the crap out of me that would have been six hundred dollars just down the drain i was like wait a minute he was there like five minutes ago where did he go the sunshine playco yesterday right after we put him in he started munching on the tilapia i had in there for the tigrinus so yeah he's doing good he's already eating i guess he was hungry you know he had a long trip and yeah guys thousand dollar fish i hope it's worth it i hope you guys like it just as much as i do the sunshine playco is eating already i'm sure the cactus is also munching on some stuff and so far it looks like the tigrinus and the Playcos are coexisting perfectly no one's picking on anyone and they're both doing great so yeah guys buying the rarest most expensive alien fish online was a huge success if you want to see more videos like these where i spend way too much money on fish eating turtles go down there and leave a like subscribe down below i'll see you guys on the next one peace out